in two and ransacking churches in Washtenaw County. Seven Action News reporter Tara Edwards spoke with two pastors who say the robbers were after the Sunday collections. It's awfully suspicious to investigators. The two church break-ins happened late Sunday night, early Monday morning. One of them off of Stamford in Superior Township near Ann Arbor. Desperation and no regard for the house of God, no regard for it. Here the burglars busted a window and after ransacking the house of worship, took off with a little cash. Across town on Church Road at Dixborough United Methodist Church, the same MO, breaking a window, but they also damaged doors inside. They destroyed most of the file cabinets in our um, church office. It's pretty clear to us that they were looking for cash. But they didn't get any. The church only had a few bucks for a coffee collection. This was such a total waste. The only money that they did find, the $9, they forgot to take with them. And so all they did was um, create an upheaval here and destroy a beautiful historic building. She suspects the intruders picked a late Sunday night after money collections are gathered earlier in the day during services. I don't think most churches in today's world keep cash around at all. While the cases are under investigation, both pastors have forgiven in their hearts. God sees all and, um, and it, it won't profit them anything. I wish that the thieves had stolen a few Bibles. At least I would have felt like th there was some good purpose in all of this. And here at Dixborough United Methodist Church, they are working on repairing this window right now. At New Bethel, they say they plan on adding much stricter security there. Anyone with any information on these cases are asked to call the Washtenaw County Sheriff's Department. In Washtenaw County, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.